All right, ladies and gentlemen, the update preview is finally here. I'm a bit late because I didn't expect it to drop at 6 freaking a.m. But we're here, we're here. Um, so basically, Assault Melee, or not Assault, um, Trader Meliodas will be here at 5 p.m. CST, or 5 p.m. CST, oh my god, no. It's 10 p.m. CST is when he will drop. So I will probably be summoning at 11, unless I get off early, but I kind of doubt it. Um, but yeah, we're going to be having Kusak, Goddess Liz, Fescother, and Margit on the banner. So very, very good units, except for Goddess Liz. But Goddess Liz is also kind of a counter to melee. So if you pull her and you don't get melee, then I guess you can run Goddess Liz to counter. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed, please subscribe and let's hop right on in. Um, so basically, uh, for us global players who don't know, there's a new attribute that Meliodas is, which is a dark typing, which essentially just de makes it so you deal 10% more damage to every other typing besides dark. Um, and when you have a dark unit on your team, your entire team deals 10% more damage to dark enemies. Uh, there's already been a light unit, uh, like basically confirmed as well. Not when they drop or anything, but like that there will be some in the future, so keep that in mind. Um, uh, after acquiring a darkness hero for the first time, you receive a darkness festival hero coin. Seven darkness essence items will be required, will be added to the knighthood shop. Yes, you will also need a whole new book. So hopefully you guys grind a bit of books today because yeah, it, it definitely does take quite a bit more books, but you can still get it done. Um, chapter 22 will be out, so we'll get an extra 30 gems for this. Um, also, not gonna lie, I think the next units could definitely be like a Saria, like the female Saria, and then the Tarvis guy or whatever, whatever Tarmio became. Maybe. Um, we're gonna be getting a new card set, which is decrease the 7 deadly sins allies' uh, damage taken from enemies by 10%. So, you know, if you use a full sins team, like, this could be pretty good. Um, all of these are free as well, I'm pretty sure, so, you know, that's nice. Um, and then we got Meliodas' outfits coming in. This is the one I'm going to be getting. I don't care about the other two. So, yeah. Um, ba -ba -ba. All right, um, this is the exchange shop. So all the units will be in the shop, and then you can exchange them for three fest coins. So every single festival is there. Very, very nice. Thank you for not uh, taking one out for some unknown reason at Marble. Um, here are the new bundles, which is just like whatever these These two okay I'm gonna say this right now the new year anvil bundle and the new year pendant bundle is very good um, the 2000 anvils is five dollars USD and the 50 pendants is ten dollars USD. I Don't know about the uh, cosmic costume enhancement bundle you guys can do that I don't really like doing it because it's just upgrading costumes, but you know if you guys really need it I guess um, and yeah so I would recommend those two also the bird bundles are gonna be resetting after the maintenance tomorrow um, I don't know if they reset whatever <sighs> I think there's like a monthly one because if you, as you see it's like a month difference so every month they reset I assume it kind of makes sense because they are gonna be releasing quite a few um, going forward, but uh, yeah. Um, these are the returning bundles where you pay like twenty three dollars, whatever, and then uh, you get to pick th three of any of these. You just pick like you could pick three anvils, you could pick, pick sixty UR zones, anything like that. Um, another bird bundle. Um. Player returning quest, so if you've done all this, then you uh, get all these rewards instantly, I'm pretty sure. So that's pretty nice. You know, I could definitely use some more card packs. Um, and then this right here, we will be able to choose our host that gives us the gift. They don't stay in the tavern, unfortunately. I wish they did. But you can choose whoever talks to you. I'm going to be choosing Derriere because she has very very nice uh, aesthetics uh, I wish it was more characters but I assume they'll add that in further down the line I just don't understand why they chose these three I could see I could see why you would choose them um, Derriere but like why not like Diane you know the other main sin or something I I, I don't know um, and now improving browsing you will now view only the heroes you select from browsing heroes okay um 
added hero skills and set teams. Ah, okay, so it's just like the skills down there. I guess that helps a bit. <sighs> I'm sorry, I just woke up. Um, you'll not be able to see if your uh, units are already 6-6, six, six, which is actually pretty nice. Pretty nice with small quality of life change. Um, this thing is not going to be the rates of what can drop, so it's like, eh, whatever. It doesn't really matter too much, but yeah. Um, this is just like the actual percentage of the fest, I think. And Jesus, that is really bad odds. I'm not going to lie. Oh my God. Um, improved bundles. Okay, cool. Um, Meliodas will be able to use on any Hell Demon. Um, does not work on Gray that well. I'll say that. But the other three, I'm pretty sure he does work pretty decent. I could do a video on that, but you know, uh, yeah. Um, I almost went right over this. Uh, we will be getting 42 gems, I believe, in total if you add all these up. Three gems every single day. So, you know, you basically get a free another multi. Um, the costume bundle is here if you guys want me to i can probably do a video on who you should buy i can probably do it later today um but yeah uh all the ssrs besides my gilda king and meliodas's outfits um will be going from 30 to 20 the ssr ones will be going from 20 to 15 <sighs> and then the sr outfits will be going from 10 to 7 i believe um, and then these units are going to be coming back. I don't know if they brought back their costumes. They should have. They are not available if you don't own the Apical Hero. Okay. Hopefully these uh, outfits are back. Is That's basically what makes or breaks the unit. Because if you only get this unit and you don't get the costume. No, I think the costume is coming back, but not the units. Uh, we will be getting a free Jericho, though. So keep that in mind. Um, the new used outfits will be coming back. Uh, I don't want any of these. I guess these aren't the new year's ones. They're all just like a mix. The adventurer ones. Uh, the summer ones. The bond one is pretty good, but now bond is dead. So, yeah, I'm not going to be getting those anymore. <laughs> yeah, th there, there's the uh, comparison. Um, this is how you can get a whole free ticket. Exchange three event materials with King, not just three materials. So you have to do like the... R pendants to pendants or whatever three times uh, use the event boss battle exchange shop five times get a bingo ten times draw a hero three times clear the Ford Sorgus dungeon two times so if you log in before reset guys you can literally get this the very next day so uh, on in America I believe you can log in on Thursday uh, Thursday late at night and uh, do all of this and then the very next day you can finish it and get your free multi so that's what i will be doing um yeah even the free draw is concluded so if you don't want to summon whatsoever you can uh still get it um you get a free one you know where you clear it one time and you get this um you get some kind of drop <sighs> i'm yawning so much um the, the, the gallon's brother it's actually pretty darn easy nowadays Our sa6 level 90 made him an absolute joke um but you get some more card packs you know some some other stuff um event goodbye 2021 bingo event um you should get another card you get a bunch more things this is how you get the free jericho so keep that in mind make sure you do it um oh my god i keep right clicking bro uh, this is how you get all the uh, exchange ticket things, the bingo exchanges, the bingo tickets. So, yeah, you can get 30 a day. And I think that that is basically it. Um, there's hero exchange or increase. Is there the demon thing free? Like one stamina? I don't think so. Um, all village shops are open, so cool. Um, Five event auto ticket clears will be given daily, which can be used in all contents that accept them. Okay, cool, cool, cool. What is this? New Year 22 Kings upgrade material exchange event. Um. Okay. Cool. I think it's the exact same, but whatever. Um. 
rewards based on diamonds used oh okay so if you spend 900 actual diamonds not tickets you can get all of this stuff it's kind of annoying they should just make it with tickets as well but at least they're clarifying that it's actually only diamonds and we're not getting scammed um we will be getting a raffle where you can potentially get up to a thousand gems i saw someone get 500 so that was pretty cool i've gotten a 30 i think on jp or maybe it was a 10 but still that's pretty nice for just literally logging in uh you log in you have to click share on this twitter thing um like it literally just says oh share on twitter and then you can just instantly exit out you don't need to actually share on twitter and then you just do the free daily fort soldiers one where it gives you the uh ur stone these are the rewards you will mainly get like right in about here obviously um but 20 people can win a thousand gems so congrats to those people who get some um Ah, you can only participate when you have reached player rank 8, so that's a bit better. You cannot participate via the PC version. Oh, yeah, probably because you can't use the Twitter one. That's so annoying. Okay. Um. And then... Uh, New Year fortune telling event. Oh, so it's completely random. I didn't know that. Okay, so every single day there's going to be a little fortune thing that pops up in front of your face. You just swipe up and y y you get one of these rewards, I guess. Okay um these i don't care about and it looks like that is it ah here's the actual banner okay i i don't know where the banner was but here it is all right um increased drop rate they are 0.25 these are 0.2 so that's a small w you know there's five of them on there they're also 0.25 um and then you have ludo sario like the, the top half is pretty good and then the bottom half is just kind of complete cheeks i'm not gonna lie like the only good one in my opinion is kind of esterosa red zelda's is kind of falling off these two units are just used for um spawning in demons and draw is kind of bad not gonna lie and the dairy is decent elots is pretty bad as well so yeah um it's pretty good uh yeah if you guys don't know what he does i mean i'll probably be going over a video um, on should you summon, I'll be going over the banner again, etc, etc. I'll probably just do a full everything you need to know about Assault Melee, or uh, Trader Melee, to be honest. So I'll just show you his ultimate, and I'll end the video. Whoa, so cool, so edgy, much wow. Boom. And there's Meliodas, so, yeah. That's going to do it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. That will be greatly appreciated. And have an amazing day and best of luck in your summons.